Come with Shedrick on their best free throw shoot. Clark in a straight jacket. Oh, he didn't need to do that. He threw it away. He and Pedis. The Farman Paladins are coming off a terrific season. Breaking records, making this season historic, and they also won a game in the NCAA tournament. But it's the offseason, and in the offseason, they plan to build momentum and find another way to potentially getting their second bid next year in the NCAA tournament. The team had to replace two key players with Jalen Slauson and Mike Bothwell. So the coaches turned to the transfer portal to build back up the roster, and they got P.J. Smith. I feel like I could just fit in, play a role, uh, defend, do whatever the team needs me to do to help us win. We also got to ask two key players, Garrett Heen and Ben Vanderwall, on what they thought we needed as a team to help lift our chances of going to the NCAA tournament. Garrett Heen says defense is the key. I think this upcoming year, something that we can work on tremendously is to upgrade our defense, you know, play better defense, get into our gaps more, be able to help our teammates out when they get driven, and be able to rebound with bigger teams. As we saw, San Diego State was a big team, and they kind of just out physicaled us, and we can, we can work on that in the weight room this summer, and I think we've got a good chance to be able to do that. And as the oldest player, Heen will also be a leader. Um, I think this year, you know, being the oldest player on the team is different. Without Mike and Slaw, always having somebody older than you, being able to talk and practice whenever things are hard. So I think my biggest thing is whenever things go down in practice or in the game, being able to be the voice to lift every back up and bring the spirits back up to where they should be. Ben Vanderwall is a 6'7 forward. He's a sophomore. I think for us to reach our goal this season, one thing we really need to work on is just improving our connection because we know how valuable that is and it's such a big part of our program. And so I think every day if we work on our connection and grow closer as individuals, we're going we're gonna to be able to achieve way more as a group than we will as just on our own. But not all the hard work happens only on the court. This summer, the team got to take a foreign trip to the Bahamas to find chemistry and bond within ourselves. Yeah, so, you know, a couple of things. The, the biggest thing is the opportunity to compete this early in the season. Uh, so we were able to have 10 practices. We're able to see where our team is, how we are together, able to gel a little bit, and then come down here and compete in uh, August when other teams have to wait until November uh, for that first crack at it. And the second part is we all get to get together, form relationships, build deeper bonds, and um, the beach. <laughs> you could say that the Palins had a successful offseason. They'll be looking to pick up right where they left off and once again next year make more history.